Hi everyone, I'm Chanel from Stamping Stilettos. I'm back with another quick case card class. This was from Pinterest and it was put on there by Sam Hammond. Now, this card is as quick and as easy as it gets. It's a single colour, single layer, apart from the uh, sentiment card. Super, super, super fast. And, um, you know, you could really must produce these cards but if you just need a card in a flash this is your card um but i think it looks gorgeous i think sometimes simplicity can be very beautiful now i'm going to try it in a different color um this one is done in cherry cobbler and i'm going to do the this one in island indigo now the stamp sets that you need are touches of texture um stamp set and we're going to be using uh, the flower and this um, lovely gorgeous I don't know what you would call that um, kind of background stamp and also this flower here um, and then we're also using the sentiment thankful grateful blessed by paisleys and posies um, so they're the stamp sets now I'm just going to shut my door because my cat's flowering Right, that's better. It doesn't sound like a baby crying and you don't think I'm being cruel to someone. Right, okay, now the cardstock is Island Indigo and it's eight and a half by five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. So let's go and um, crease that now. And all you will need is a piece of Whisper White, which is four and one eighths by five and three eighths, and another piece of Whisper White, which is three and a quarter by one and a quarter. And that is it. So let's go ahead and do our stamping. So we're using Island Indigo. And I'm going to take uh, the background stamp first. I'm just going to make sure that this is nicely inked up. Now I really don't know what it's going to look like in this colour. I'm sure it's going to look absolutely fantastic. And we're going to just go across... Uh, let's say about the middle there. It doesn't really matter if it's not exactly in not the middle, is it? It's sort of further up the top, I should say. It doesn't really matter where you put it um, because I think it will look amazing wherever. Then we're taking the flower image and we're just going to pop that down about. there like that oh i love this color and then we also need sorry i forgot to say you do need a piece for the inside of your card which is four and one eighths by five and three eighths and i'm just going to take the flower image this is flower image i should say like a flower head and i'm just going to put off the corner there and then off the corner there i thought it'd be a bit different on this one so that's that and then on your sentiment piece we're bringing your piercing mat because these are the photopolymer and we're just going to ink this up I've used this um, particular sentiment quite a lot because it's um, just a lovely um, sentiment as all of them are but I just love this one I think we have our go-to um, stamp sometimes, don't we? Or sentiments that we just oh gosh, I hope that's done it. Yes, there you go. Look at that, just gorgeous. Love it, love it, love it. And that's it, that's all of the um stamping. Seriously, this card is probably the fastest one I'm gonna make yet. So we're just gonna adhere this down. And obviously you can use any sentiment. You don't have to have such a thick um, sentiment piece. You can make this smaller and do your banners. And what we're going to do is pop some um, dimensionals on here. I must admit, I do love quick cards quick cards that look amazing but I also like sometimes you know a, a more 
in-depth card that you've got to get your teeth into, you know. But, um, right, let's have a look. Pop that down about there. And um, I'm going to pop this down inside. Let's make sure we get this around the right way. inside like that and then I have um, took some of our linen um, <coughs> thread and I've already made a bow and taking a glue dot if I can find them here they are <coughs> and I'm just going to roll one up because you don't really want to see it too much so I'm just going to take one and roll it and pop that oops Down on them. I just need to snip that because I think that's a bit longer on one side. And I'm just going to pop that sort of about there and make sure we can see the tail. And then um, the card did have some Wink of Stella on it, the one that's on um, the case card. So it's going to go ahead and pop a little bit of Wink of Stella down on the flowers and by doing the Wink of Stella it does pull out some of the colour from the ink which is quite nice as well so we're kind of colouring it in at the same time so there you have it there is your single colour quick case card class super fast works in any color as i just proved there and how fast was that in fact it was i can't see on the screen because my thing's blocking it but that was super fast right even for me making boo-boos which i didn't actually do on this one um so i hope you enjoyed this very super 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 fast quick case class card class um Please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I love, um, you know, uh, your comments. You know, you're so lovely, all of you. And I really, really do appreciate you supporting my channel. And um, I shall see you soon, very soon, for another quick case, ca case card class or a tag or something. I think I'm going to be doing a tag at some point, either tonight or tomorrow. Um... And I'm not sure what else. I'll have a look for something super lovely for you as they all are. Thank you again. Take care. Bye-bye.